I'm headed south on the 405 freeway going down to Fountain Valley, which is quite a long drive. There is a big breakfast that's happening down there and I've been invited to because this year I'm going to be the Grand Marshal for the Fountain Valley Car Show. It is a great group of people, some amazing cars, and we're going to have a blast. But this, this breakfast is kind of to get everything coordinated. Driving the 2017 Nissan 370Z Nismo Edition. This is their race edition. It's very fast. I plan on getting there in about uh, 50 minutes or less, but it's an amazing car and having a blast driving it. All right, I'm finally down in Fountain Valley. Oh, a little on the tight side. I met up with Ken. He's uh, right in front of me. I'm gonna follow him over to where this meeting is. Is the deal with Fountain Valley Car Show? Well, it's pretty big. Yeah, this is our um, our breakfast that they're having for the actual show. 240 people in Applebee's all having breakfast at the same time. But we're so special because Applebee's doesn't serve breakfast, only to really? cool car guys. Oh, yeah. So that's right. really cool. The cars out here are quite amazing. Grand Marshal, Grand Marshal. Where? Right there. Oh, right there. Grand Marshal for this. Uh, what what is the date for this show? That's a good question. Yeah, I'll put the date right here because we don't know what it is. So you guys know, but we don't know. At least not right now. Hang on, I'll know right now. Yeah. This is Pete Hawk, the gentleman behind the Fountain Valley Car Show. Um, how long has that show been going on? This will be our 11th year. So Pete came to me and said, hey, would you be the Grand Poobah or something like that? Yep. Right? And then, you are. And then how many cars do you generally get at the show? Oh, about 300. A little bit of everything. Uh, you guys will hear a lot about it on the blog as we get a little bit closer, but uh, this is going to be some amazing cars. So thank you very much for having me. Thank you for coming. All right. Appreciate it.
chill. Enjoy myself. He's got an amazing voice. <laughs> Tell me about Horsepower for an Hour because um, uh, I just had an absolute blast today. It's good having so you on board. Fun. It was good. So we are the largest automotive talk radio show in the country. We have 157, I think, stations now, uh, coast to coast, AM and FM. Also, every military base in the world via wow. the Armed Forces uh, American Veterans Radio. Too much fun, good man. Good stuff, yeah. Too much it's all fun. about cars. It doesn't matter whether it's old or new, fast or slow. It's got four wheels and a steering wheel. It's us. And what's the website? The website is horsepoweronline.com. Right here. There it is. Thank you for having me, man. Great to have you here. Good stuff. What an amazing group of guys. That was an absolute blast. Went by way too fast, and I have no idea how to get out of here. Go this way. So that'll probably air in a few weeks, but uh, as soon as it does, made it outside. As soon as that show airs, I'll, I'll make sure I put a link, but absolutely had a blast with these guys. Uh, big thanks, Spence and Donnie, for having me over. Loved it. You just meet people that you gel with. You know how you you kind of you, you go into a room and you suddenly feel this vibe, feel this this coolness uh, uh, that's going on in this place. And that's the way I felt when I went up and saw the guys from Horsepower for an hour. What a great name! I had an absolute blast with these guys. You know, it, it's just one of those things that you you feel like you're talking to your brethren. Uh, things flow and you just have a great time. It makes things just cool. You know what I'm talking about? 